We use GPS on a daily basis. But what are GPS coordinates and how do each of us do we know how they work? GPS coordinates are a unique identifier of a precise geographic location on the Earth, usually expressed in alphanumeric characters. Coordinates in this context are points of intersection in a grid system. GPS coordinates are usually expressed as the combination of latitude and longitude. Lines of latitude coordinates measure degrees of distance north and south from the equator, which is zero degrees, the North Pole and South Pole are at 90 degrees in either direction. The prime meridian, located in Greenwich, UK, is zero degrees longitude, and the lines of longitude coordinates are measured according to 90 degrees east and west from that point. GPS coordinates are expressed in two different formats. Below are the coordinates for the Empire State Building in New York City. North 40 degree 40 for minutes 55.7 for 1 to seconds. West 73 degree 59 minutes 7.5 for 08 seconds. The GPS system makes use of the geographical lines of latitude and longitude to provide coordinates for a person's location or a place of interest. Let us see one by one. Lines of latitude. Lines of latitude are horizontal lines that stretch from east to west across the globe. The longest and main line of latitude is called the equator. The equator is represented as zero degree latitude. Moving north of the equator, each line of latitude increases by one degree, therefore. There will be lines of latitude representing 1 degree, 2 degree, 3 degree, and so on up to 90. In this image only displays the 10 degree, 20 degree, 30 degree, 40 degree, 50 degree, 60 degree, 70 degree, 80 degree, and 90 degree lines of latitude above the equator. You will notice that the 90 line of latitude is represented by a dot at the North Pole. All lines of latitude above the equator are indicated with the letter N to denote north of the equator, therefore. We have 15 degree north, 30 degree north, 45 degree north, and so on. All lines of latitude below the equator is indicated with the letter S to denote south of the equator, therefore. We have 15 degree south, 30 degree south, 45 degree south, and so on. Lines of longitude. Lines of longitude are vertical lines that stretch from the North Pole to the South Pole. The main line of longitude is called the prime meridian. The prime meridian is represented as zero degree longitude, moving east of the prime meridian. Each line of latitude increases by one degree, therefore, there will be lines of longitude representing one degree, two degree, three degree, and so on up to 180 degree. The image above only displays the 20 degree, 40 degree, 60 degree, 80 degree, and 90 degree lines of longitude east of the prime meridian. All lines of longitude east of the prime meridian are indicated with the letter E to denote east of the prime meridian, therefore. We have 15 degree east, 30 degree east, 45 degree east, and so on. All lines of longitude west of the prime meridian are indicated with the letter W to denote west of the prime meridian, therefore. We have 15 degree west, 30 degree west, 45 degree west, and so on. Reading geographical coordinates. Global navigation makes use of lines of latitude and longitude to pinpoint a particular location. On the Earth's surface, it is given as geographical coordinates. Thank you for watching and Joe with the exploring longitude and latitude unveiling the mysteries of our planet. Do not forget to click the subscribe. If you want more daily abates from Be a Tourist from your home,